<laughs> oh. <laughs> so, hey, this is this is Clyde. No, no. I'm out here. Oh, I'm I'm here with my boy oh, no. Trey Mac. We not out here, yeah, though. yeah, we out here. No, we, <laughs> we out here. Out here. And, and 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 I'm 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 sitting here right now. Well, man, it, it's, I know I just said your name. Introduce yourself. I'm Trey Mac, man. We not out here, man. We just this is just the interview. We in the car right now. We're very safe. We're trying to sound real tough. But, <laughs> there's nothing cool about what we're doing. Well, this is the thing. I'm cool. Matter of fact, no, scratch that. He's cool because he's with me. All oh, right. Okay, man. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to be in your presence, bro. Hey, man. It's it's my pleasure. Yeah, it's my yeah. pleasure to make make people cool. We we gonna make it. He's on a walker. Hey, yeah, you ain't got to tell all my little business, but that's cool. Some of y'all, some of y'all know I, I did. I broke my leg, so um, and and he has had no mercy for me all day. Oh yeah, we try to treat him as horrible as possible, just to show him that we love him. We treat you, we treat him bad today, man. Been leaving him behind, making him walk long distance. This is actually true. I they they will like get out the car and then they leave me and I'm on a walker so by the time I get there they're leaving they're like bro well, you missed it I'm like, ah. anyway but I'm out here he is a he's a a, a a comedian and he's like on his way to the the small time yeah, you know time. <laughs> I'm doing an interview in a car <laughs> while I'm driving <laughs> yeah, yeah. I ain't nobody Hey man, I I broke my leg on my driving foot. I can't. That's all I can tell you. But uh, man, hey, tell us, tell us, tell everybody a little bit about yourself, sir. Man, I'm uh, Trey Mack. I'm from a, a city, uh, much like Chicago. It's uh, Adamsville, Alabama. Um, wait, wait, a Adams? Who? Adamsville, Alabama. Where is that? I've never heard of that. It's in Alabama, man. What you you go go? What's that next? Is that close to anything? Uh, it's it's in Birmingham, I'll say. It, it, yeah, it's in, in Birmingham. Okay. Okay. All right. Cool. Please continue. I apologize. Yeah. No, I'm from uh, uh, Birmingham, Alabama. I've been doing comedy. For, what? You said just tell me about myself a little bit. I'm sorry. Yeah, I mean, tell, whatever you want to say. Oh yeah, I've been doing comedy for almost six years, man. Uh. I filmed my first hour special this year. Say what? This bro got a special. Y'all clap it up for him. Clap it up. Somebody. That's my job. Okay. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Let's do that again. Wait, wait. Let's do that one more time. Hold on. Let's take it back. All right. All right. Which, what you going to take it back with? Uh, from before we started clapping. So. Okay. Are right, you ready? All right. Yeah. All right. Uh, I recorded my first hour special this year. Say what? He recorded his first hour special. That's man. Y'all give him a clap, man. Right, it's right. <laughs> a, a bad idea. Uh, you can find it on Apple Music, Spotify, uh, or you can follow me on Instagram. That's Trey Mac Live. Trey with an E Y Mac with a C K Live with a V E. Say that again. Trey with an E Y Mac with a C K Live with a V E. One more time. Trey with an E Y Mac with a C K. Alright, that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. <laughs> that's Damn. enough. <laughs> Get you a physical copy so you can pop it in your DVD player and see it live. I put a lot of work into it, man. I'm really proud of it. Oh, what, what's the name of the special? It's titled. It's entitled "Have Fun." Have fun. Is that? that that's that's just have fun, huh? Hey, you know what, Clyde? I got to give you your, your props. You're you're a great interviewer <laughs> because you're acting like you don't know these questions. <laughs> you know what I mean? It is. It's really getting me going. Uh, it's called "Have Fun" because my. When I first started doing comedy, my mom never came to my shows. So she, Damn. Yeah, she just, she, I don't know. But she would always tell me, hey, have fun. And when I would come home, she wouldn't ask, did you do good? Did they laugh? Did you get paid? She would be like, did you have fun? And they kind of shaped the way that I think about comedy. So no matter what I do, I got to make sure that I have fun. You know what I'm saying? And that, that takes a lot of pressure off of it, trying to, yeah, I know what you mean. See, see, you know, see what I appreciate. This dude is real. You know, he's real because it's not even, you know, two minutes into the interview and he's already got a story about his mom. That's real. And he has applied it to his life in such a way that you can see it physically. If you get a copy from him or if you go online to Spotify or Apple Music, Apple Music to get a copy of Have Fun. Uh, actually, I... I want to tell you, I have, I have, I have seen, I've, I've seen the special, 
And um, it's actually really good. If y'all want to look up, I mean, I know y'all don't y'all don't care about what I say, but if you listen to me right now, you should. Uh, it's really good. So check him out on Spotify, Apple Music. Um, hit him up and get you a physical copy of it. It's it's definitely worth your time. I promise you. So like, so when you do you just do comedy? Do you do anything else or like? Boy, oh, you good? Come on, man. Uh, I actually I'm starting to do music, man. We have a group called the Collective. talented individuals who have different talents, but we bring our talent together, and um, we help each other, we put on shows, and we just, we, we trying to take over the world, basically. Oh, yeah. man, that's dope, man. I, I, I hope you do that, sir. Yeah, man. Just, just make sure that you, you know, put off, put off a little corner for your boy, you know, like Clydesville or something, you know, just a little spot, a little space. You. you gonna have your own handicapped parking. I... <laughs> 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 All right, so that concludes our interview. We're just going. <laughs> no, so wait, okay, so so you, so do you do you do you sing? Do you like what do you do in the collective besides sling jokes? I mean, what? How does that go? Uh, we well, yeah, I with my jokes, I incorporate my music into my jokes. So, um, honestly, we haven't done anything yet, <laughs> but we plan on putting on shows, and I host, and since I'm musically inclined, I sing and rap. Uh, I can like. Uh, be a good host for the show and introduce the artists such as Jay Walk, you know what I mean? He's a rapper. We got Tyrell Poole, he's a rapper. Cack Beats, graphic artist, producer. We got OC. Hey, am I forgetting somebody? Capri. You know what I'm saying? Hey, we, we got a, a team of uh, really talented individuals, guys. I feel like and all of them got the, the same mindset, man. We focus on what we want to do and uh, man, I'm, I'm excited about it. The, the collective squad that's what i'm talking about shout out to the family that's my squad right now yeah, man in the collective man so so you like so you also you sing on stage while you're performing your stand up yeah i do man i started doing that in in shreveport louisiana um the open mics they didn't have no comedy open mics when i first got here all i could find was musical open mics so i would i would sign up and i would tell some jokes up front i would treat the jokes as if they was an introduction to the song i was gonna sing at the end this brother's innovative yeah so i would i would act like hey no this is just an introduction i'm not really trying to do a joke do a hot five minutes (laughs) and sing a a two two minute song at the end man so uh that made me comfortable i always sang i just was never comfortable doing it in front of people i was in the choir that's like background type stuff so uh, it made me more comfortable and somebody told me, Yo, you can sing, you should incorporate that into your comedy and uh, that's like one of the main places I pull my comedy from now. So Shreveport, hey, shout out to Shreveport for that. I don't yeah, Shreveport helped me grow a lot as a comedian. Damn. That's like my lane, singing. You know what I mean? Singing and doing comedy. Man, I gotta tell y'all, like I grew up in Shreveport. I have never heard anybody give Shreveport a <laughs> shout out. Like they y'all helped me grow. Shout out to Shreveport, man. <laughs> shout Shreveport, out to Shreveport. Hey. Shreveport made me a great comedian. I, wow. Uh, wow. Shreveport. Shreveport that's that's amazing. I'm I'm glad to hear that. Like, well, I, I don't wanna put you on the spot, you mm-hmm. know, but you you got anything that you feel you know, give a little taste of like a song or anything. I mean I we don't have to do it right now, but no, maybe no, maybe no, later. We're doing it now. We're just doing it live. We're doing it now. Doing it live. Okay. <laughs> song it's not released yet but um it's called um uh, it's me oh lord it goes by somebody pray for me had me on their mind took the time and prayed for me i'm so glad they prayed i'm so glad they prayed i'm so glad they prayed for me it's me it's me oh lord Standing in the need of prayer, I know you'll always be. I know that you'll be there. It's me, it's me, oh Lord. Yeah, yeah. Standing in the need of prayer, I know you'll always be. I know that you'll be there. I said that it's me, my God is me. I said that it's me, little low me. I said that it's me, my God is me. I said that it's me, little low. Somebody prayed for me. Words spoken, doors get knocked down and windows wide open. Strong and he loud, my God be so potent. Told me life's a game, but he gave me one token straight up. What you do it for? I can take you places where you wanna go. I got all the answers, what you wanna know? 
Cause I can make your after so much better than before See my brother, my family, ayy hey. God's got a plan for me, ayy hey. I know that he'll stand for me So lift up your hands for me My sister, my family Don't you be scared for me Don't shed a tear for me Just send up a prayer for me, amen Hallelujah, it's me, it's me yeah. Oh man, y'all listen to this boy. Y'all, y'all to hear them bars in there? I hope y'all caught some of that, cause that I mean he was he, he you know he's got some 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 thinking and some spiritual and some and some notes for y'all. I hope y'all man. We got a lot of stuff coming, man. We we've been we haven't released anything officially yet, but uh, we working on a lot of music, man. I'm working on my second comedy special right now. Um, Everybody on the team is working on uh, solo projects, man. It's I'm man, I mean I'm excited, man. Man, we are gonna see this boy Coachella 2023, folks. I'm just Come saying. On. 2023 Coachella, that's the movement, man. That's what we're trying to get. We got five years to get there. And I think we can do it. You heard me say it before it, it was anywhere. Yeah, you said it first. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, but that's what's up, man. Dang, that's that's cool. So, so you say you've been doing comedy almost six years. Like, who who influences you in comedy? Who are your comedy influences? Please, please don't say Bill Cosby because he just got indicted. I mean, he just got like convicted, I think. Oh, so, man, man, man. actually, I'm saying you you can say Bill. You can say Bill. Is it Bill? If it's Bill, you say it's Bill. If it's Bill, if it's Bill, say it's Bill. It's if not, it's Bill, say it's Bill. It's not Bill. It's not. You you, you just man, did you just did you did, did you just disrespect Bill Cosby? <laughs> it's like me saying uh, Richard Pryor, man. I, I grew up. No, nah, that was before my time, man. I was from a whole different era, man. Oh, man. Um, he is. I, man, my favorite comedian guy, a guy by the name of Carlos Miller. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know Carlos Miller? Man, I watch Wild and Out. See, but you don't know him, though. See, hey. you see him on, in, like, I'm talking about his stand-up. I've seen his stand-up. Oh, yeah. I have. I have seen the stand-up. Yeah? Yeah, I, I really have. Okay. But, I mean, not live, because I don't go nowhere, but I've seen it on online. Okay. No, I like Carlos, because every time I see him, it's a different show, and he is the epitome of getting on stage and just having fun. It's like he don't even prepare. He just hop on stage, and it's a classic show every single time, and that's what I aspire to be. You know, it's, it's, it's like he don't worry about Right now, I'm, I'm real planned. I'm real planned. I be like, I know what I'm going to say. I know how I'm going to say it. And I stick to the script. But Carlos, he just be on the stage free with it. He's just a funny dude. It's like, yeah, man. It's like he lives and breathes comedy. It's not, it's not hard for him. So he just, he, he really makes me laugh. And he's fun to watch. Carlos Miller, man. Another guy by the name of Funny Man. Um, comedian from Alabama. Yeah, I've I've seen uh, Carlos whenever he does it, it does it feels like he's just it's just coming out of him, like like it just happened. Yeah, I, yeah. I I yeah, that's that's like that's true. A, a funny conversation. Yeah. With, with one of your homeboys. Yeah, that's really funny. Yeah, it, it's like sometimes he'll just start dancing and you feel like it's not planned. It just kind of happened. Yeah, I never, have you seen? I have never, you? I've never seen. I, you know, maybe it's not really dance. He'll just like move in a weird way that just seems spontaneous. If that makes any sense. Carlos Mill, like he, I, I saw, I saw him perform one time. This was uh, back in probably 2007 or something. I so it maybe it's not, it doesn't apply no more. But he just like started like moving, like jerking his body, and it's weird. You know what? We're not talking about him anyway. I, I, I like Carlos. He, he's, he's funny. 2007. Hey, I, I'm t- man. I, I, it's 2018. Hey, man. I, I watch, I watched, man. He just, oh, he been doing it longer than you. That's all I'm saying. He's been doing comedy for 13. Yeah. You said aside from eleven years ago. I like did. <laughs> Jesus. I, maybe back in the day he had a different style. I don't know, man. It was just it was the way he did it, it was very spontaneous. It might not have been two thousand seven. I feel like it was it might have <laughs> been two thousand eight or nine. But anyway, it was a it was a while back. It was before he put on the, the cap. Oh, he still had hair. Yeah, he, he had the hair on. He you know, he had his hair. So this is so this was a while back. Yeah, that was wild back then. So like so right now, so you've been, you've been doing a comedy like almost six years now. So you got any you got any comedy groupies yet? <clears throat> uh, no, not that I know. They they ain't told me if they if they groupies. I ain't heard from them. Um, no, I ain't got I ain't got no groupies. I'm not good with the ladies anyway, so I probably never I probably couldn't either. So y'all can't see this, but he has got this face on this expression like he is trying to lie so hard right now. Uh, 
Yeah, he is like, he was like, bro, I can't, I, I can't go on record with all this. Mm-hmm. If like, if I could really tell you the story, bro. That was my God is good shirt. That was my God is good. Hey, by the way, this dude got some shirts. If y'all do follow him, uh, if y'all find him on Instagram, what's your Instagram? It's Trey with a E Y Mac with a C K live with a G E. There you go. If y'all follow him on there and you see, he actually has these shirts. It say God is good all the time. Shirts on. If you check these out, y'all need to go ahead and holler at him about copping those because they actually, they pretty, they pretty clean. And he also got some hats too. But anyway, I don't want to. I'm, I'm, I don't want to plug this stuff for you. But I'm just saying, like for, for real. Like you, I, I've never seen a shirt like that. So that's why it's, it amazes me. Like he's got one on right now. He, he, he keeps one on. Like he got the hoodies. He got the t-shirts. He got the hats. I mean. I don't know if if he's gone in, if he's talked to uh, Fruit of the Loom, we're gonna deal with them on that. I don't know. Haynes got him. I don't know. But anyway, man. But this this the thing. These uh a lot of the people who listen to this, a lot of them are in New Orleans. When you gonna do a show in New Orleans? Real soon, man. Real, real soon. Real I'll take soon. it. That's how you lie. I'll t- <laughs> hey, I'm hey hey man. I'm out here, bro. Hey, hey, but you know, you know what this dude he he does he travels a lot he does he does a lot, and I I anticipate he's he's about to go on like uh, an international tour real real <laughs> real, soon. real soon, and and so you know I uh, uh safe travels with you on that and much success much love. Appreciate it, man. Hey man, well I tell you what man, hey hey um I heard something about you on a like a comedy like a competition or something. Yeah man, uh Suru, stand up roundup. Man, it's an opportunity to win a comedian can win $5,000. Man, ain't no comedian ever made $5,000 before. <laughs> <laughs> not, on, not, not me. You know what I, mean? I don't know about other people. Not nobody that I know. <laughs> I touch that. So, um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to uh, be in it because I'm leaving the country pretty soon. But I got accepted in it, man. But did, I, did you got accepted like real hot, though, didn't you? Yeah, I was the number two. Number two, out of how many? Out of forty. Out of but no, how many like tried out though? I know it's more than forty. Oh, a lot of people. A lot of out. man, this dude like number. I, and and it's the thing, y'all. I mean, like it's a competition out of a, out of. Like, I'm sure it was hundreds of people because, uh, I saw I saw like some of the the list of, of names of people and they did a video on it. This dude for five thousand dollars, he was like, and this is just qualifying, right? He number two, just qualifying number two. That means that he 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 went in there and was like, all right. I'm gonna give these dudes these jokes I tell my mom, <laughs> and he came in there and got and got second qualifying, yeah. you know. I, and I mean, he ain't even like he ain't even like brought the heat to. I'm just saying. So y'all check this dude out, man. I I know we we got to get out of here because I just heard like a, a horn or a siren or a, you know somebody's a, uh, a queef or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> man, is there anything else? Anything you want to let people know? out there about you about about what you got going on there's anything what's on your mind right man now? i have to say shout out to clyde williams man ah. shout out to clyde williams for doing the interview nobody's ever interviewed me before let alone while i was driving you know what i mean he made it happen we didn't even we weren't even at a uh a, a stationary location he was just like hey bro let's get this uh, interview in i don't know how it's gonna turn out but let's do it so shout out to him for that initiative and this was a dope interview, bro. If don't nobody else hear it, send it to me. I'ma listen to it. Hey, hey, that's what's up, man. I appreciate the shout out. Um, um, you know, I'm I'm happy to do it. And uh, real quick, since I'm in here, I'm gonna give a shout out to Jay Walk. Jay Walk in the back. Say what's up, Jay Walk. What's up, family? What's up, with you? Where you from, boy? Chicago. <laughs> hey. hey. you didn't know. Uh, hey. Hey. Kanye, biggest fan. <laughs> so. Hey, give it a Hey, so to give y'all some context, so y'all understand. We've been with, we've been hanging with this dude for a while now. Anytime he says anything, he gotta tell y'all. It's like, first of all, I'm from Chicago. You know, uh, you <laughs> it's gotta like understand. you gotta understand. I'm from Chicago. Like everything he says, but that's typical of the people from Chicago. Yeah, yeah. Don't don't get nobody from the South Side of Chicago because you 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 won't make it. Yeah. You you won't make it. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, hey man. <laughs> Uh, again, it's your boy Clyde. Shout out to the family. I appreciate y'all listening to. Finna get out of here. Bring us back now. <laughs>